Hey guys, welcome to your general reading for Libra. This is going to be for your October 2024. You can apply this to any of your placements <coughs> because anything could come up. We're going to take a look and see what you guys need to know for October. So apply this to your own unique situations. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post, when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Also, if you guys are interested in booking a personal reading with me, the link for that is also in the description box below. All right, so... Libra. What messages do we have for, for Libra? What does Libra need to know for October 2024 for Libra? For Libra. All right, Libra. So we have the Six of Wands here. It seems like you guys are, ver uh, are experiencing victory and success at this time here with the Six of Wands. With the Knight of Wands here, I just feel like there's an energy of you guys just going for it. Going for what you want, okay? Going for what you desire, going for what you're passionate about at this time here. Lots of fiery energy right now you guys are tapping into, okay? So we have the Six of Wands. And the Knight of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Energy. What else do we have here for Libra? And also the Hermit. Okay. Seems like you guys are also doing a lot of introspecting, self-reflecting here. Yeah, seems like you guys are going within. Trying to find your inner desires here. Okay? Trying to find truly what you guys love to do. Now, another thing I could be getting here or that I'm picking up is that, you know, you guys could be in hermit mode, okay, trying to avoid someone in coming back into your life, all right? Like, you know, at this very moment here, you know, I feel like you guys are definitely feeling very victorious and very successful, feeling just really good about yourself, feeling very confident at this time in your abilities and what you guys want to do here, all right? What else do we have here for Libra? What else does Libra need to know? Look out for, work on, for October 2024, for Libra. Okay, Libra, we have the hangman here and the hermit again. Seems like you guys are finding some sort of spiritual enlightenment here. Yeah. You know, so I, you know, one of the things I'm also getting is that you guys are seeing the light at the end of the tunnel here. You know, one of the things I'm getting is I feel like you guys are no longer sacrificing yourself for other people. You guys are going for what you want. You guys are going for what you truly desire, what you really are truly passionate about. Okay. What else do we have here for Libra? Four of Pentacles. And the Three of Wands here. Some of you guys could be saving money at this time here for a move also. Yeah, it seems like you guys also could be making some really big plans for you guys at this time here, or that you guys have really big plans that you guys are making here. It does seem like there's a move in the future that could be happening for you guys in the next three weeks, in the next three months here, all right? I'm feeling like more like within weeks, okay? Let's see what else we have. We have the Ace of Wands here. And we have the Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Energy, and the Fool. Seems like you guys are really tapped into this energy of just taking risk here, enjoying new experiences, just being excited of what you guys are moving towards and what's to come here. Seems like you guys are seeing the whole picture, a bigger picture here, okay? I'm going to take this Fool card. And also clarifying this hangman, the full Aries energies. How about the hermit? Why is the hermit here? The hierophant. Wow. I feel like you guys are going through some sort of huge spiritual awakening here. A huge release here too. Releasing anything that's no longer serving you. Releasing any, releasing any sort of burdens here at this time. You guys are just letting things go. Anything that's not serving a higher purpose in your life here, you're just letting it go here. What else do we have for pentacles? And the lovers. 
I mean, this could also be an indication that there's someone here that is in love with you, that's refusing to let you go. Yeah, someone here is refusing to let you go. Or that you're finding harmony, peace, and balance in your life at this time here without this individual being in your life. All right, tell me about the Three of Wands here. And the Ace of Cups, wow. Seems like there's someone here pining for you, yearning for you here. Seems like someone here can't stop thinking about you. You know, it's so interesting. Everyone has love on their mind for the month of October. When I do these types of readings, I tend to like to step out of love and do something, you know, outside of it. But it seems like, you know, I mean, you might not have love on your mind, but the person that you might have been dealing with here has love on your mind here, on uh, their mind. Uh, perhaps there's new love coming into your life. Perhaps whoever this is, this person's chasing you hard, fast here, very passionate about you. Does feel like a bit of a love bombing energy here, so I feel like you have to be careful with that. You have to be, be really discerning what this individual here and trust your intuition. The Ace of Wands here. <clears throat> In the Knight of Cups, yeah, it seems like it seems like more and more that there is someone here approaching you here. There's someone here falling in love with you. There's someone here just that's really excited to get to know you, uh, to see what unfolds here. Here's the thing, Libra. You might get a kind of like an inkling that this person that's coming into your life here is really immature here and I feel like you guys have grown so much that you guys might not even go for this here because you're realizing that this person is not in alignment with who you are as a person here. The Page of Wands and the Three of Pentacles here. Another thing I'm getting here is that you know moving forward and work you could be collaborating and working together with a lot of different people here okay I do feel like there are projects that could be coming up that's really detrimental to kind of like the end of the year uh, statistics, okay? So, you know, I do feel like moving towards the end of the year when it comes to your work here, you guys could be really, really, really busy. The Six of Wands, why is the Six of Wands here? Nine of Wands. Seems like you guys are a little burnt out. I don't know, I, I feel like also you could be dealing with someone here when it comes to romance, even the friend or a family member here. You know, they're a bit of a firecracker here. Like, someone here in and around your energies just have a lot of energy here, okay? This could be, uh, you know, kind of representative of the new love that's coming into your life here. Knight of Wands. And the Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Hmm. Could be dealing with a strong fire sign here or that like i said you guys are just tapped into this fiery energy here at this time really going for what you want here okay going for what you truly desire or that there is someone here that really truly desires you and this could be new love coming into your life here the hermit and the magician gemini virgo seems like you guys are really making your way here really manifesting the life that you want here Seems like you guys are definitely going through like a really deep spiritual transformation here and I feel like changes are happening for you. Now, my only concern is like I said, this person that's coming into your life when it comes to this new love, I don't feel like this person's on your level. That's the only concern here. But overall, I feel like things are going pretty well for you guys. Uh, um, uh, uh, Libra, okay? So Libra, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.